Gosh. <gasps> max the skill. She max the skill. KT is a master horse rider. Hey, a horse rider. Get it, KT. Did you see that move? It's like she was showing now. <laughs> Can KT hear me? <laughs> Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. You're watching Just a Mom That Sims. I'm KT, and I'm back with you today for another KT's Horse Ranch Adventure. I hope you enjoy these adventures with my sim self as we go into a time jump. So as we get started, I'll update you on exactly where KT and the fam are. We are here with Lena, who has aged up to a teenager, and I'm going to very quickly take you through her makeover as she has transformed into her teenage self. She's looking very cute. So also we have Joshua, who has aged up to a child, and this is Joshua. And the KT household has been steadily moving forward. So we'll go out into live mode. Jordan has made some more progress in his nectar making. He is now a level four. And the nectar making skill moves really slowly. And we expect to have met that $100,000 for nectar sales very soon. And all the free time he has, he makes nectar. KT is now a horse riding level nine and she is 92 percent complete so i expect to see her hit that goal today moving on lena has her best friend ka they are best friends now they exchange friendship bracelets and lena did max out all her skills before she aged up and joshua also maxed out all his skills before he aged up Lena is going to just help around the ranch real quick, get it cleaned up. We still are having to call the ranch hand in every single time we want him to come out. KT should get her level nine. But also, I want to go over here. Dunn is progressed some in her skills and her agility and jumping. And we have been sending all of the horses out for training. Uh, Buttermilk has definitely progressed because I believe he was like a level three. And he is a level five in agility and jumping. And Sunny, we have not been riding as much, but we have been sending him out for training. And you can see that his other skills have built outside of his temperament. And our little cult here, Glue, it's doing pretty well too he's a temperament level four now and so <clears throat> that is where the kt household is and i am gonna quickly put walls up just to show you their rooms lena is still a teenager so i have left a semi childish aspect to her room but we cleared out the toys and put in a chess table and a guitar and we have moved some toys and toy chests over here to little joshua's room who is a child now and i changed the wall colors on his on his wall and changed his decals to the sun and i put the three horses on the ground and lena very much still likes horses but let's look at her her panel because oh go jogging i'm gonna send jordan for a jog um okay so back to her she's cheerful loves outdoors logical she's also a fashionista she has high self-esteem the top nine infant trait she inherited um high metabolism she inherited the essence of flavor from kt and she is alluring from choosing a love aspiration she wants a soulmate so she wants a boyfriend or girlfriend and she wants to go on two dates jordan is coming back from his jog he's already changed 
Jordan was always a big guy, you know, he always had weight and he also had a very high muscle build. He's been jogging every day and he's lost just a little bit. And we're proud of that because if some of you are like me and you get older, it is not always easy to get that weight off. And that's okay. We got to love ourselves as we are. And I'm going to have him come over here his social is pretty low so i'm gonna have kt come back and and talk to him and just engage in conversation so i have been on curse forge since the last time that i played kt kt is thick too honey and i downloaded a mod that gives us some Yo, more bitch, interactions We've been working on Jordan's jealousy issues. And so I'm going to go ahead and do this interaction because it's coming back up. Compliment his helpfulness because Jordan really keeps this ranch running. I will say that we haven't had as many jealousy issues like it was constantly before, as you all saw. Um, so it is improving. However um it comes out sometimes and and change is progressive but change is a decision and jordan has committed to being better because kt is faithful and that she's not about any type of cheating lifestyle and so i'm gonna have her come on over and um in her a novice tournament she goes to work today but she should have time this should build her skill set up see this swept off my feet from romantic comment and if we go over here thank you it's always nice to know that my efforts are appreciated i love you too and i never get tired of hearing you say sweet things <laughs> she said you have a sweet you know what and he says you're lucky you're cute and so he he likes being flirted with. I'm going to have him come over here and clean the horses. Something else we've been having to do is steadily refeed their feeder because with four horses running around, it goes fast. We have also taught glue to eat out of the feeder so we still bottle feed him sometimes but he is eating out of that feeder i do see that the uh ranch hand came on his own today so that's progress could do work from home this time so she will be late soon so they can get a little woohoo time uh lena's last math test was not her best work uh should she do some extra credit Let's do some extra credit. And she got a small performance game. Jordan, Lena won a school prize. Should we give it to her in front of the class or quietly in private? Give it to her in front of everybody. Like, recognize the kids' hard work. That's also hoping that um, if you craft this at a higher level nectar, that it'll help your skill move up faster. But that is completely just me you know, wishing and hoping. We're gonna do an intense ride and she's going in her skirt, so get it, KT. And hopefully she can get to level nine. He's gonna talk to him about family and to me, that's gonna be the importance of family. Uh, hi, May. Uh, what's her name? I can't remember. Uh, can you please move out the way? <laughs> We're gonna cuddle and... I'm going to tell him about the good old days. And, oh, oh my gosh, this is just. Uh, can I do this without her in the picture? Let's see. Pause. <laughs> can I get this screenshot? They'll be out of frame, but it's okay. Okay. Because she's all in our picture. Um, Jordan is just loving all his son because. They need that love too. He's gonna compliment his hair, build up their self confidence, and we're gonna do a teach to say please and thank you. Let's zoom in with KT. Oh my gosh, she is almost at level 10. So we're gonna stick with her and see if she gets it. And also, this is so helpful because, oh my gosh, <gasps> max the skill. She maxed the skill. 
KT is a master horse rider. Hey, a horse rider. Get it, KT. Did you see that move? It's like she was showing out. <laughs> Can KT hear me? <laughs> Jordan is about to get another parenting skill. Um, Let's see. He's at level seven right now for parenting. And so is KT. And look at that level 10 horse riding skill. Oh, you know what? She's supposed to be doing work tasks. <laughs> she needs to stream a let's play and be funny with different sims. So, okay, let's get on it because I completely forgot. Look at Lena's cute self. She is very sad from having a mood swing. Okay, it's all right. KT's going to tell you a joke. How about that? <laughs> That's what we're going to do. <laughs> Is she getting it? Oh. Okay, I think I think we got it. Let's let's do a joke. This should be it. Yes, that's it. So let me. I'm gonna have KT eat and then. Go to the restaurant. Oh, pregnancy yeah. test, which shouldn't happen. And, uh, oh, she needs to stream. So let's go to games and let's live stream. My sounds go. And she needs to do that for four hours. So do a soothe and snuggle. They are best friends forever, BFL. And so I want to kind of show you what the what ka looks like now that he's aged up and it's funny because his eyes are closed but girl now your arms in the way okay so you can see ka he aged up to be quite handsome kt's midlife crisis has passed and i'll be honest we did not do any of the things that she would have liked to do for that ka is in here cleaning our toilet uh we did go and visit him and his mom and his little sister the other day let's do teen stories and activities and let's do ka these are the options we have um Go on a road trip, go to a convention on a date, play cards and board games with friends, go to the beach and drive around, camping, bowling, movies, nightclub, house party, college party. This is my first time using this mod and I really liked the idea of having teens do stuff. So it's showing Lena gone into a rabbit hole. So that's pretty awesome. Other than grilling, Jordan doesn't really cook um kt does most of the cooking he does most of the grilling kt does most of the handiwork like fixing things but jordan is good with that as well while he does most of the ranch work cleaning up the horse poop that is everywhere um that whole you know everything with them cleaning the horses when it's time to be a team, they are a team. If one person can't do it, the other person jumps right in with no hesitation. So, um, K A seems to have had fun. What I want to do is craft the energy nectar, and I want to see what it's worth as soon as you craft it. These at the top are the ones we mostly just put in and these at the bottom uh have been in a little bit longer so look trash nectar finally aged i'm gonna sell it let's craft some more nectar let's do energy nectar again uh this is finally aged prairie grass nectar we'll sell it oh here energy nectar um, I want to see if it ages to, and he got this ambrosia, horse brosia treat that can bring a horse back to life. And I know that there's a ghost horse. I got a peep of him once up on the cliff top, kind of by the cave that Jordan's been going to explore. And that's also why we have Leaf, our, uh, little mini goat in our inventory. The first time I tried it. 
that did not work but it definitely worked this time Selena's gonna come and sit right here too and she's gonna squat down like her dad and i don't know why she's facing the opposite direction but hey sims and she is going to eat her cake and i'm just gonna tell her yes he definitely likes stories i'm just gonna tell her to sit here and eat and yeah girl just sit there and eat and i'm just gonna have them all talk about just nothing everything and nothing lena wants to kiss someone just kind of got a house full of people i don't know if joshua is still helping his mom or not but i will see and i'm gonna go ahead and line up for kt to cook one more meal and i think collard greens and cornbread would be perfect for uh thanksgiving look at that collard greens and cornbread oh my gosh lena is going to reveal a little crush that she has on ka they are bffs and i think that that's not unusual seeing how much time they spend together let's ask out on a date let's do that Lena has had a crush on K.A. She's just feeling her feelings change recently. Lena is asking him on his date because she just wants to kind of tell him that her feelings have changed for him. And she's just telling him that he is cute. She is just chatting with him, asking him to tell her about him, even though they are BFFs. She just wants to know everything there is to know. And so we're going to just discuss interest because really on this date, we need to get um, 10 interactions. And so just getting to know him a little and she is <laughs> just kind of flirting a little oh, bit and they got a little bit of a romance bar going so he is Talk interested bracelet buddy Slacking fist bump because they have exchanged friendship bracelets and if we turn this way Abisai. you can actually see Abisai. lena's Abisai. on her arm down here so i'm gonna have them do their interaction She's going to tell him, hey, my family yeah. thinks we're dating because he says, stop, you're making me blush. Because that is yeah. something Bogan that KT oh. has talked to Lena about Wait, and bro. she's giving her the woohoo talk and we'll probably Whoa, do it again. Because <laughs> she wants her, no, don't you come oh. around here uh, with any babies. Oh. And so... And, and they hang out all the time, and she doesn't want Check. to stop them from hanging out because they were already friends. I'm going to have them swim around together, too, so they can enjoy this water while they're here. And they need to be flirty at the same time, and we're going to not worry about that. If it happens naturally, then it does. He thought that was crazy when she said our family thinks we're dating. And so we're going to try to go from, a, we're going to try to do a first kiss. It's a little early on the romance bar, but let's kind of see what happens. You know, the Sims, they got to sit down in between every interaction. <laughs> oh, and they did their first kiss. Regular kids, and do you have an extra heart? Let's see what that interaction is. Uh, oh, y'all doing a lot. Hey, kids. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm a rainbow hero. Do you have an extra heart? Mine was stolen. Gold medal date. Great job. Luna is back home and feeling very flirty. And it looks like the house is cleared out, so thank goodness. I'm gonna have Jordan get over here and fix things. Uh, I'm gonna have Dunn do the jumps. And once he fixes these, then we can have Buttermilk race the barrels. She wants to talk about love. 
Yes, I've been doing great. Thanks for asking. Life is good. Oh, I love this mod. That mod with the mega interactions <laughs> is a Kate mod. So K A T I E mod. And I did download it from Curse Wars like most of my mods. I, this, I love this thing. And it's intuitive. So it picks up about things that's kind of going on around you. So I, oh my gosh, I would definitely be keeping this one in game. They're annoying. Uh huh. Hueva. Parsicon. Yeah. <laughs> you know, just take your time. <laughs> You're young. You have time. <laughs> Talk about the Talk. Is that a Girl, you singing in love, but stop. We're going to talk about the Hoo Hoo Talk. She is. Let's talk about it. He might look good, girl. He'll have strong muscles. And this and then that. <laughs> They're both wow. embarrassed. <laughs> you have responsibility to, to be Who's good. In? You should not be doing the woohoo with oh, your no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> This will now be Joshua's bike. I'm going to have him put it in his inventory. And this will be Lena's bike. Honey, you know your daughter is in love, right? <laughs> Jordan's like, wait, let me look up... Uh, what can I do about this? <laughs> and she doesn't want him to uh, to just obsess about it too much. So she's just going to give him a little searing kiss. And I do believe this is where we will leave our episode off. And again, I just love KT's family. We will stick with them from generation to generation. This generation will go forward with Lena. Uh, but we will stick here as her and KA's romance bills or doesn't feel. It may be someone else she meets. Until next time, keep simming, be happy, and always have a blessed day. Bye-bye.